What's up YouTube? It's your boy Pretty Boy Forbes and now back with another reaction video. The damn bots react to the performance by Doja Cat of her song Wet Vagina. If you're new to this reaction channel, feel free to subscribe, like the video, and turn on post notifications for all of my latest updates. And if you're already subscribed, I appreciate it man. And welcome to the family. With that being said, let's start the reaction. Listen to me. I, I just wanna I wanna talk about something right now. Is she like dancing in a pool full of shit right now, bro? Like is is I'm 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 tripping right now. It can't be real. Did they just make a set out of man? Let's hope not. So I don't know the wet vagina song, so I can't can't really compare it to the song. But I'm just gonna rate the performance of how vocal delivery is, and if I, if I can actually understand what she's talking about, and how her breath control is, and just how the song sounds over the live band. So so far, it's a little bit disturbing of seeing her dancing and shit. But I I, don't, I can't really judge on that. So let's see how the how the performance continues. What can I say, man? Visually, this is something, something new, and I can see that with Doja Cat, she's always trying to break the boundaries of what is accepted as a female artist, and it's really good to see something refreshing like this. And as somebody with mental health issues, you can look at the greats like Kanye West, Essex and Tashian, or even can look at Machine Gun Kelly, suffering from depression, anxiety, and other mental health issues like ADHD, ADHD with the Joyner Lucas, and it always contributes to good music and as supporters i'm loving this and how she can open us into her vision and show us what she sees and how she feels about the world so i don't know what the mud stage illustrates man the shit that's on the stage but hopefully there's a deeper meaning but let's continue Okay, she's not really into acting with the crowd. It's not a lot of crowd work. It's just her twerking and playing around in mud or shit or sand. I don't know what the hell this is, but she's just playing around in it and just, I don't know, expressing herself, getting some of her emotions out, man. This is honestly one of the weirdest performances I've seen in my life because she's not even trying to entertain the crowd. And with regards to the mic and the sound, you can't really hear everything that she's saying because her projection and her breath is really off. So I don't know, maybe she's tired or her lung capacity is really weak, man, and she just, she can't keep up with it. And it's really distracting. But just how lazy this is, no choreography, the set is lazy, just her sitting in shit and that's really disappointing but i want to see where it goes maybe she can still shock me with it let's continue So all of the backup dancers is playing in the mud right now. So it's just a mud party. Uh, hopefully there's a mud fight going to happen right now. Because that's really exciting to think about. Maybe they're going to fight. Maybe they're going to start playing around. Throwing each other with mud. And it's just a whole lot of girls playing in shit, bro. And honestly, um, 
this is something not in my wildest dreams that I would think Doja Cat would do for a performance, bro. Like, this has probably never ever been done on this stage at this Coachella, bro. And she's really pushing the boundaries. I don't think that this is going to be a good performance for her, but... I don't know, man. Maybe the crowd likes it. Because so far, the crowd is quiet. Nobody's even screaming at this shit, bro. Wow. All spread out, bro, in the mud. Let, let me be honest with you right now. This performance was hot, bro. The sexual energy on that stage, she was this close to fucking, bro. That's what's gonna happen on that stage. If the music continued, those girls have probably got naked with her, bro. That's how good the performance was. How good they were acting, man. And I started to believe it. I was into that shit, bro. So what do I think about the performance? What do I rate it? Was it good or bad? Or was it a trash or a pass? I gotta say, first of all, one of the standouts was that it was so unique. I haven't seen a performance like this ever in my life. And that's a really excellent idea to have the audience shocked. And Doja Cat's really good at that. Regards to the whole storyline behind it, the, the song, it's about a wet vagina, bro. And she's saying that that shit can get dirty. Obviously, when you're having sex and it's all the fucking love juice is going on and it's just going crazy. And that's why the muddy's there to say that this shit's about to get messy, bro. And then we had a girl on girl shit happening, just playing in the mud. And they were being really provocative. And they just they were just trying to create the imagery of the sexual tension and how they are in the bed, in the bedroom, man. And how they can be freaky like that. So what do I rate it? Honestly, it had me, bro. It had me looking. I didn't even look away once. And it had me captivated. For that reason, I got to give the performance a 6 out of 10. It's definitely a pass, but I feel like there could have been more to it. It was a bit basic. With that being said, thank you for watching. Like I said at the start, don't forget to subscribe, like the video, and turn on post notifications for all of my latest updates. I'm out.